Just a quick video here. I saw an interview with Jamie TKV, British heavyweight, gym mate of Anthony Joshua. And in this interview, he said that Anthony Joshua dominates Alexander Usyk now, if they were to fight again. This is off the back of AJ's performances against Otto Wallin and Francis Ngannou. And Jamie TKV is not alone in expressing this sentiment. There have been loads of other people, boxing pundits, fighters, trainers, etc. And of course, many of Anthony Joshua's fans. I find it all very puzzling. AJ beat a guy in Ngannou, who was an MMA fighter, who was 0-1 as a professional boxer. I said all along in many videos that Anthony Joshua would have no trouble with Ngannou at all, that he'd beat him comfortably, easy peasy. And of course, that's what he did. That's what he was supposed to do. How does that have any bearing on how he would do against Alexander Usyk? Ngannou's not in the same universe as Usyk as a boxer. And we could talk about the Wallin performance, but people weren't saying that AJ demolishes or beats Usyk now or dominates him after the Wallin fight. They were saying it mainly after the Ngannou fight, which again, it's very puzzling. The Wallin performance would be more relevant because Wallin is at least a proper boxer and he's a southpaw. But as I mentioned in some of the pre-fight videos I did for that one, and in the post-fight videos, Anthony Joshua was very familiar with Otto Wallin, beat him twice in the amateurs, sparred him loads in the pros, and according to Richie Woodall, handled him with ease in the gym. Actually had to carry Wallin through some of those sparring sessions because it was so easy for him. So when you're going in there against someone like that, of course you're going to be confident. Of course you're going to know what to do. And if you're not confident going in there against the guy who's only ever had one boxing match before in his life, Francis Ngannou I'm talking about now, if you're not confident against a guy like that, then you should retire. So I'm really puzzled and perplexed as to why people all of a sudden think Anthony Joshua dominates Usyk now after his last two performances. It's bizarre to me. He was well beaten twice, back to back. Alexander Usyk, seriously, is one of the most disrespected champions in boxing. People act like what he's achieved since he moved up to heavyweight has been a series of flukes or something. <laughs> I have seen absolutely nothing in Anthony Joshua's last four fights to convince me that he now dominates Usyk. Not just beats him, dominates him. That's what Jamie TKV is saying. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below.